In the book of Matthew, we read, Jesus' name shall be the hope of all the world. Hello, John Stanley here. And it is in Jesus that we have hope. Someone said that discouraged people have lost their courage. And we know what it is to be discouraged, don't we? Gene Kerr said, hope is the feeling you have that the feeling you have is not permanent. Again, hope is the feeling you have that the feeling you have is not permanent. Jesus said, in this world you will have trials and tribulation, but be of good cheer. Beloved, I have overcome the world. Jesus is saying to us, I am the hope to your hopelessness. Isn't that very good news? Jesus is the hope to our hopelessness. When we are concerned about our health, when we're concerned about our finances, when we're concerned and worried about our future, we can remember Jesus' words. In Matthew chapter 6, Jesus asked, Who, by worrying, can add one single hour to his or her life? We have hope. We need not worry. Now, we may have hope in one hand and a handkerchief in the other, but we may be concerned, but we need not worry. We remember, worry is like a rocking chair. It gives us something to do, but it surely doesn't get us anywhere. May God bless you until we are together again. Thank you.